Yo, what's going on guys, your boy Free here, and welcome back to another video on Madden 21, guys. We are back on the pack opening grind today, opening up packs for the new promo that did just drop, the ultimate kickoff promo for the start of the NFL season tonight, Chiefs versus Texans. Comment down below who you guys got. I mean, I think the Chiefs are actually going to win tonight, but I'm going to be rooting for the Texans because I'm a huge Deshaun Watson fan, but other than that, Madden dropped a new promo, ultimate kickoff. And it actually has a good bunch of content that I actually want to go through and open up packs today. Now, there's not much I know about this promo. I only know the higher up cards. I know there's 480 overalls. I think it's Yannick Nguakwe. I think I probably botched that one. Trent Williams, Todd Gurley, and Lival Joseph. With the master actually being Byron Jones and the limited time behind your screen, Brandon Cook. So, Brandon Cook is pretty much the reason why we're opening packs today. As you guys know, the All Saints team, he's going to have a spot on there. And that's going to be a great addition with the speed. He's going to be one of the fastest wide receivers in the game. Like, up there with Tyreek Hill, I hope after this and plus when powering him up and all the saints chemistry he'll be faster than tyree kill i think the cool part about this promo bundle is that we are guaranteeing 88 overall so i'm thinking by the end of this i'm gonna probably pick up todd Gurley for you guys and probably drop a gameplay as soon as possible so expect a gameplay for todd Gurley. but other than that let's just hop into this bundle right here take a look at the odds except i mean the topper is a guaranteed 80 overall but these are the odds for the regular pack so we're gonna see a lot of 81 overalls Maybe some 83s, 85s, hopefully that 90 overall Brandon Cooks be our pack. So we're going to purchase the bundle and let's just get right into it. Now there's 17 packs in here. Let's just fly right through it. I mean, I don't know what to expect out of like uh, lower tier cards, I want to say. So maybe they got some Saints players for the lower tiers that I can pick up. I definitely have to pick the ultimate kickoff player Saints cards, but hopefully, all right, this is getting a little weird. We need to see an animation. Are we only guaranteed one? As oh, Okay, so it's looking like an 81 overall Ross Block, Black Lock, I should say. But that's like the rookie animation. All right, so I guess the rookie core rookie card animation is going to be the, uh, I guess, ultimate kickoff players unless EA botched it again. But, okay, so, yep, that's going to be our guy right there. Brand okay, well, I don't even know any of these guys so far in this promo. We're just going to keep flying right through. I mean, I just don't, I, I wish they had a better animation for it. They need a better animation. They need to get on their stuff. As, okay, 85 overall Robert Quinn right there. That's actually a pretty solid pull because I'm not sure. I think that's one of the higher cards that we can actually pull here. Hopefully these cards actually go for some good coins and I just keep rolling along like getting coins for squad builders and the All Saints team and just building dumb lineups for you guys. As we got 81 overall right there. As I just got to keep going. I mean... Other than this, I think these are more like set pieces that you guys can put, or you can pull them up on the auction block for sale. So I just wanted to check out the promo. I want to see if we had a chance of actually getting like an animation and end up pulling Brandon Cooks. I mean, as of right now, I don't think we're, I'm really going to expect it. Like, it could be this card right here for all I know. And I wouldn't even know. I just think it's like a core rookie card every single time. I was so thrown off of, about that. And they're only like guaranteeing it's one. So I guess that's why there's at least 17 packs. But. Other than that, come on, give me something. Oh, wow. That, see, that was actually a core rookie. I thought that was going to be an ultimate kickoff player, but I think this is our one. I don't even do... Whoa. All right, th this has to be it. As Okay, 81 overall. At least we're guaranteed an elite in each pack, I guess. So an 81 plus isn't too bad. And, I mean, depending on how much people like the Masters, like Todd Gurley and all them, I mean, they're probably their prices aren't going to be that high just because everyone doing the bundles. But, I mean, I definitely think for the Byron Jones, some of these cards are going to go for a lot because I know, like, the budget guys are going to be grinding out, like, these solos and stuff like that to get these kind of cards. As Mario Addison, okay. I mean, we only got 185 overall pull, which isn't that bad. And, I mean, we just got to keep going. I mean, we just got to keep going through this. I want to get... Oh, actually, oh, that's the... That's the rookie for the Chiefs right there. That's actually a rookie premier upgrade. That's actually kind of sick. Well, now that I know that uh, Clyde has a rookie premier card, now he's upgraded to an 81 overall. And that's actually pretty sick for me right there because when I was trying, I'm actually trying, oh, 85 overall Josh Lambeau kicker. All right, sweet. But I'm trying to actually do an all rookie team squad builder to start off the squad builder series for you guys. And honestly, whatever we can get out of these rookie premier guys, if they get upgrades, because they're going to be on the squad either way. So the better, the better upgrades they get, the better for me. At first when making the lineup, it was like all like 70 overalls. And I was kind of worried, but like if my guys or the rookies are actually getting these upgrades, that would be sick. As, all right, we're getting a lot of 81 overalls. I mean, can we get another 85? I think we're, we got at least two 85s and one of them wasn't even from the promo. One was Josh Lambeau. But we need like a bigger pull. I don't even know if there's like a big animation. We'll see from the topper, I guess, as, okay, we, okay, two for one right there, but they're both 81 overalls. That's not bad. Maybe the highest overall we can pull is an 85, but... I want to see if we can get a Cooks. I want, I want to see the animation for it. Like, this animation is... Like, I can't even tell. I, okay, 83 Jack Conklin. That's a 
different person to see than an 81 overall. That's not too bad. Hopefully these cards are going pretty good because the promo did just drop. So I mean, hopefully when I start selling these guys, they go for some coins. I'm going to try and get gameplay with Todd Gurley. And then, okay, Chase Young too. Chase Young's got an 83 overall. All right, that's sweet right there. So rookie mirrors are getting upgraded like that too. All right, guys, this is the last chance of pulling Brandon Cooks. I pretty much just wanted to get like a little preview of the promo for you guys. I wish I could pull an LTD in this video, but I guess not. As, uh, I mean, we're at least guaranteeing 88 plus pull. And we got some pretty good pulls, pretty good news about rookie premieres, in my opinion. As, okay, Christian Kursky just end off this pack. All right, guys, time for the topper. And I'm most likely going to go for Todd Gurley here. I mean, I want to just see if there's any different animation for these masters. As, uh, okay, all right, this is the fantasy packs are a little bit annoying because you have to open them twice. But let's see. As, come on, gotcha, we bitch. We only get a different, an that's ridiculous, right? We only get a different animation, but. Okay, so here are the 488 overalls that go into Byron Jones' set. Looking it over, I think we're going to go with Todd Gurley just for gameplay reasons. I wouldn't mind just rushing the ball with Todd Gurley, so be on the lookout for a Todd Gurley gameplay either today or tomorrow. Unfortunately, guys, we did not pull Brandon Cook today, and unfortunately, he is actually going for a large amount of coins right now, 1.8 million. Even though I do have the coins to buy him, I just don't think that's worth it. He does have 91 speed, though, so when power up, you have 92 speed. And with the Saints chemistry, you have 94 speed, so that's almost the fastest wide receiver in the game, or fastest player in the game, I should say. So, definitely going to get Brandon Cook soon. I mean, if anything, if I can snipe his limited card for cheap, I will. And I'll also get a game with you guys, but be on the lookout for other gameplays like Sam Mills, Mutt Master, everything like that. More videos to come, guys. And also Todd Gurley as well, so just put and post notifications on, and I'll see you guys all next time. Make sure to like, subscribe, and peace out. I just got to read these holes really well, and oh, <laughs> just like that, Jerome Bez is trucking down the field. He needs a little bit more speed, or else he's going to get caught here by Jesse Bates. Oh, no, it's not looking like it. That's a 